Jaden, here we are. How do you feel to uh, sign your first professional contract with Norwich City? Oh, I can't describe the feeling. It's been amazing. Even just being invited on trial, like such a surreal experience. And I remember the phone call. My dad told me I got signed. It was like it was very, very proud moment. Yeah, I was going to say, what was your sort of initial reaction to hearing that news? I, I didn't have any words. I was just really excited and like for all my family, after all the years, all the knows from other clubs to finally get yes it meant a lot to me. Yeah, what, what's the experience been like because this is your first academy isn't it? Yeah I mean it was a bit nerve-wracking at first obviously Cat 1 a really big academy um, but the coaches all the players were really welcoming so yeah I settled quite in. Yeah and it was only March this year when when you joined the club so has it been a little bit of a whirlwind kind of with how quickly things have gone since then? Yeah like I think I trialled um, earlier on in the year and um, she started off in March, but um, yeah, things went really fast. I was playing a game straight away, which I really enjoyed, and yeah, it's really good. Yeah, has it been all positive? Have there been ups and downs? Yeah, um, I started off, um, I'd done a few friendly games, and then I got injured for like two weeks, which was a bit frustrating, but no, the, um, when I got, once I got back, I was playing games straight away, which I really enjoyed, and it was a great experience. And to know that the club have shown that faith in you with the professional contract, is that kind of motivation to keep doing what you're doing on yeah, and off the pitch? Definitely, because obviously not having been signed before, not even as a youth player like from the 9s to 16s, to be given a professional contract was a really proud moment. And what's it like being able to see the academy graduates who have gone on to appear in the first team for Norwich, perhaps something that happens a bit more here than at some other clubs? Yeah, it's something that me and my parents talked about it was a really good club to go to. I'd heard that it was one of the better clubs to progress at, so seeing players going up into the first team is really encouraging, so yeah. Yeah, so it sounds like your, your parents, your family are a big influence on you. Can you tell us a bit about the influence of the people here at the training ground, so your teammates and, and the coaches and how much they've helped as well? Yeah, definitely. Like I'd only known one player previously outside of the club, but everyone else was really welcoming. As soon as I came in, everyone was giving me encouragement to do well. They thought I was doing well. They kept giving me advice. So it was just a very relaxing environment. I didn't feel stressed at all. It was every day coming in, working hard. Yeah, it was really good. And then something that the first team players have said in the past is that how supportive they are of each other, whether they're playing or not. Is that kind of similar in the academy? Yeah, ages? I think even with all the other goalkeepers as well, like uh, Sam and um, Reese and all the others that I've trained with have all been really supportive of me. So it's just helped, helped me with coming into a big club like this and felt, felt the support, so that was good. Yeah, so you made a number of appearances uh, last last season in the under-18s Premier League. Um, what are your targets now going forward next season? Obviously start off with the 18s, um, hopefully finish strong in the league. Um, obviously the FA Youth Cup, well, FA Youth Cup is a big competition, so hopefully we can go far in that. And um, obviously I trained a few times with the 23s already last season, so start to train with them more, hopefully get, as my aim to get a game or two with the 23s this year. I see him.